of the Central West End's busiest streets, a set of big eyes watches over the life that passes by. Don't worry if you blink, you won't miss this art. Other splashy bits of paint loom on lar looming large across the Central West End. And new here at 6, our Nathan Vickers introduces us to the artist behind the big murals painted with a purpose. Mm -hmm. Along a busy street in the Central West End. There's a bit of a hustle and bustle. Tugler Cheatham has created something eye catching. So this piece is called Color Block Beauty. A beauty staring over Euclid Avenue in the same storefront where a car crashed through a window earlier this month. The owner of the building commissioned Cheatham to paint over the plywood in its place. They've done other similar projects in the neighborhood too, including the snowflake angel wings at the McPherson building that burned more than a year ago. It's currently being restored. You see a boarded up business, a boarded up window, it's so discouraging. Instead, they've turned it into public art. Instead of it's just being something like a piece of wood there, it represents more down here. Public art is just a good sense of community. It enhances the stature of the community. Cheatham has done a total of six murals here in the Central West End. They've also been doing live paintings at street fairs and other neighborhood events. For them, there's a pride in turning something damaged into something beautiful. To have artwork that you can keep looking at, keep appreciating each time you pass it, uh, it's so different. In a few weeks, the glass will be back. In general, engages with people in a way that that allows them to step outside of themselves. But Cheatham hopes the impact will last. In St. Louis, Nathan Vickers, First Alert 4. I always love those splashes of color throughout the neighborhoods. I am all for anything that just brightens up our mm -hmm. days when we walk by. For Good sure. stuff. All right.